Everyone loves slot wall because it's so versatile. But if you use slot wall, then you know the problems with it. Such as? It's very, very heavy, and it is also very weak. As you can see, it's very difficult to handle. Yes. This is our competition slot. You see it will go in the middle. It's really heavy. Okay, so now we're just going to put it on the shelf, the same way we did with the uh, saddle slot. We're going to put 40 pounds weight on the shelf. How much are this? 40. I'm going to put it right over the bracket. It's 40 pounds. Yeah. I'm going to just put it right here. It might be out of the way this time. Very flimsy and it's very heavy. I can't even look this up, Patrick. Could you come help me for a second? I'm just thinking this way. Uh, not really sure. Let's find out. Uh, it says. 103 pounds? Is that right? Yeah. 103 pounds? Yes. Okay. Yeah, 40 pounds. Okay. Okay, and uh, this is a double-sided slot, as you can see, too, so you can use it for both sides for merchandising. And um, this one has a lot more strength. You can see it's, it's not going to bend like the other one will or break, whereas if I did it with that one, it's not going to happen. Okay, now we're going to do a strength test on the horizontal slot wall with the weights the same as we've done on the rest of This is that dimensional parcel board. Slot wall. And I'm just going to put the weight on the lip like we did with the others. See, this is probably the problem that you've had with the, with the particle board or the slot you've been using. Um, even though it has this aluminum extrusion in it, it's still just not enough strength that will rip it up. Okay, cool. So now what we're going to do is I'm just going to show a comparative test with the nylon slot uh, next to the ordinary slot. Like a 40 pound weight. They don't look much more than that. This is just one one bracket to hold. I mean, 100 plus pounds. Well, one of the brackets will hold 80 pounds, whereas this can barely even hold 40. So now what we're going to do is we're going to show you the strength of the silent box. And I'm just going to add on the weight the same way we did over here. Right on the tip of the edge, we have the most weight on here. You can probably put an 80 pound weight on there. Now Chris, can you put the other 80 pounds over the, over the same bracket? Yes, sir, again. Yeah. 80 pounds in one bracket. 